about this holiday makeup look i really love how it turned out i think it is so pretty with the glitter liner it's very glam so you know it has a little bit of glitter in it so if you want to see how i achieved this look then just go ahead and keep on watching okay guys so i'm going to start with my tarte shape tape concealer to prime my eyes so i'm going to be using the morphe 350 palette first gonna go in with the vanilla shade right here So I'm first going to go in with this shade right here. Then I'm going to go into this other shade right here and I'm going to use this on my crease with a fluffy brush. Then I'm going to go into these other two shades and I'm going to be using this on a more precise brush on my crease just to darken the whole look up. Then I'm going to go into my concealer once again and I'm going to use this to cut my crease in a very tiny brush. You guys know I love doing this with every single look. And then I'm going to go into this really dark brown shade and I'm going to place this over my lid. And I'm also going to be blending it into my crease. Then I'm going to be taking some MAC Painterly Paint Pot and with a small angle brush I'm going to create a wing liner. And then I'm going to go into this NYX Holographic Glitter and I'm going to just place this right on top. Then I'm going to go into my Farsali Rose Gold Elixir. I really love this oil. It's very hydrating. And then I'm also going to be using my Maybelline Matte and Poreless Foundation in the shade 110. And then I'm going to be blending it out like magic. Then I'm going to go into my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer once again and just place this directly under my eyes to conceal and blending it out with my Beauty Blender. To set everything in place, I'm going to be using my Kat Von D setting powder and then I'm also going to be using this Too Faced um, Peach Translucent Powder to set my foundation. To contour a little bit, I'm going to be using my Too Faced Milk Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. And then I'm going to be using my Milani blush in the shade Luminoso, which is my favorite lately. And for highlight, I'm going to be using my Wet n Wild highlighter in the shade Precious Petals. To finish up our eyes, I'm going to go back into this dark brown shade. And with a small brush, I'm just going to buff this on my lower lash line. And then I'm going to go back into the Wet n Wild highlighter and I'm going to use this as my inner corner highlight. And then for mascara, I'm going to be using my Maybelline Lash Sensational Curvy Toad Mascara on my top and bottom lashes. And then for lips, I'm going to be using this NARS Matte Lip Pencil in the shade Corella. Okay guys, so here is the final look. If you enjoy this video, please do not forget to go ahead and subscribe. I have a lot more tutorials coming up for you guys for the holidays. Thank you guys as always so much for watching and I will be seeing all of you on my next one. Bye.